Well, Thanksgiving is all about giving thanks and enjoying a nice hot meal with your family. But some families weren't able to bring dinner to the table for the holiday. Ten on your side's Walter Hildebrand shows you how one local organization stepped in to help. This morning in Chesapeake, volunteers were putting the give in Thanksgiving. We're almost full over here. The Buffalo Family and Friends Community Days is a center that feeds the hungry. Today is our 13th annual Thanksgiving Community Dinner. Michelle Buffalo is the founder here, and 13 years ago she saw a need. I saw a need to feed our community. And here in Chesapeake, we have no soup kitchens that are available on Thanksgiving Day. So th 13 years ago, I got with my family and friends and asked, is this something that we could do? And here we are 13 years later, still strong and standing. And you can't do that without some help. We have a large group of family and friends, people that come into our community pantry every day, and they are here serving today. We are doing mashed potatoes and green beans, and we've got gravy and yams. We've got all sorts of great food out here today. Volunteers are cooking while containers are being packed with all the necessities of Turkey Day, then boxed up and carted out. These are going to the South Norfolk area and Military Highway area. Representatives from the Navy, local sororities, and community leaders all came out to help today. The center also found time to deliver meals to those processing the scene at the Chesapeake Walmart. They took the meals. It's still an active crime scene, and we respect that. We wanted to do it because it's bad enough the tragedy that happened right here in Chesapeake, but these uh, individuals are working on such a very pinnacle day. The center also hosted a Thanksgiving dinner to anyone who wanted to come by. It's very important. I know a lot of people out there today are looking for a hot meal. In Chesapeake, Walter Hildebrand, 10 on your side.